Santoku versus Gyuto. Santoku in Japanese means three virtues. The idea is it's good for slicing, dicing, and mincing, or meat, fish, and vegetables. It's very comfortable for most home cooks because it's only about seven inches long. It's very versatile. You can get a lot done with something this size without it being too large or intimidating. The Gyuto tends to be a large blade inspired by the European chef's knife. Gyuto means cow sword because the Gyuto is meant to have a little more of a meat bias of this longer slicing blade. People who like bigger knives or have worked in a professional kitchen often prefer a Gyuto because they come a bit longer. 210 to 240 millimeters is pretty standard, around 9 to 10 inches. Functionally, they're pretty similar, but the Santoku is a little bit more of a flat belly. So when you come down on the cutting board, it's going to contact a little more completely. A little better if you like to do these sliding cuts, uh, as opposed to the Gyuto, which is designed a little more for the rocking cut that those of us in the West often prefer. I prefer a Gyuto, but I use both at home and I love them both. Which one do you prefer?